It's another episode of Whoa, Prince! And now, your host, Lido Pimienta! Hello, everyone, and welcome to Woke Prince, where a woke white girl upsets her privilege by hooking up with the wokest man of color. And her prize? <laughs> the chance to make a beautiful biracial baby and become a woke queen! <laughs> Today, our lucky lady is Grace, a 27-year-old social media consultant from Vancouver. Grace, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? So, I'm Grace, a white, cis, hetero woman who has mostly dated white men. I know, but now I'm here to find a beautiful man of color to build a life with. It's the least I can do to help eradicate the white race. Wow, you really are taking one for the team. Now let's meet our three contestants. Meet Trev, Jordan, and Clark. Hello, gentlemen. Hey, girl. Grace, are you ready to find your woke prince? I can see your cute little babies already. I am, I really am. My first question is for contestant number one. Hello. How many white girls have you dated and will I be the first? Um, that's a bit of a wild question. Um, sorry, how is that relevant? It's relevant because I think it's really problematic when BIPOC guys only date white girls. Wait, aren't you white? Yes, but this is different. I have a goal. Well, yeah, I've dated white girls before. Okay, Grace, contestant two, all yours. Imagine a future where a race war is occurring. It's getting pretty wild. And you have the choice to save me, the mother of your children, or let me die with the other more evil whites. What do you do? Well, I guess it really depends. You're the mother of my hypothetical children. <laughs> But you're also white. I think you get a pass for being the mother of my children? Hey, hold on. One more chance, one more chance. Hey, wait, what? How is that the wrong answer? I'm not gonna let her die. Wait, ah! Wow. <laughs> this means we're at our final prince. Um, can I just say, I don't want to be here anymore? I mean, what happened to the other guys? Who was carrying them away? Hopefully you don't have to find that. Over to you, Grace. It's the future, and our child is grown. While there still are white people, there aren't many, thank goddess. But our kid wants to marry a white person. What do you do? God, I don't know. Um... Answer! Answer! Well, love is love, right? This isn't going well. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to be boyfriend and girlfriend with this lady. I don't want to be a prince. Please, please. No, please. Where's my mom? Grace, ah. this was really an episode for the book. <laughs> I'm so sad I couldn't find my woke prince. But those guys all have a lot to learn about race. Speaking of race, <laughs> we have one more twist. <laughs> Our producers did some research, and it turns out that Grace here is currently active on dating apps, but messaging exclusively white guys. Is this true? Wait. We have a zero tolerance no policy on performativity, Grace. And unfortunately, you are. <laughs> another episode of Woke Prince. Tune in next week when we'll see if we can finally help a white lady ease the unbearable burden of her privilege. <laughs> oh, wait a second. Um, I'm getting a message in my ear. My producers are saying my baby daddies are both white. So I'm... Um... Oh, wait a minute. Yes? 